Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Evidence and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to load a data set from a URL inside Visual Studio Code. So first thing is first, let's create a new Python file. So if you are on Windows, you can just do Control Shift P. And I'm going to create a new Python Jupyter Notebook. And first thing is to import pandas as pd. And let's run this cell. Here I'm getting a data set from the UCI website. And from the UCI website, you click on data folder. And one that says dot data content is one is a URL that contains your data. So you can just right click and copy the link that has the data. Then you go back to Visual Studio Code. And since we already have pandas imported, let's just call this Abalon. And we use the pd.readcsv function. And in quotation, put in the link that has the data. And we'll play this. And now just make sure the data is loaded correctly. There's the data set right there. Alternatively, you could have easily done this. And then subsequently, let's call this Abalon2 equal to pd.read csv. And you type in URL or let's just call this. You can just call this URL or whatever you want to call it. And you type in URL right here. And run this cell. And then if you do Abalon2 dot head as you can see the data is also loaded so that's how you load a data set using a url in visual studio code and the benefits of using a url is that the data is always available you don't have to worry if you move to a different folder if you move to a different computer and don't worry about your data not being available right there. And all, but the downside of using a URL is that you have to have internet connection in order to be able to retrieve this the data in this URL. But that is it for today's video. I hope you like this. If you do, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.